Hi Georgie Burns here. Today I'd like to show you how I made this card. To make this card I used the stamp set Dress to Impress. And I'm going to use the perfume, shoe, the flowers, both flowers and the lipstick. And also the saying be as bold as your lipstick. I've already got them out I think. For the card stock you will need A pink card base, pink, this is lovely lipstick, of 8, no, 11 and 3 quarters by 4 and a quarter, no, 4 and 1 eighth, I am really confused today, scored at 5 and 7 eighth, fold in in half and burnish, two pieces of white at 5 and 5 eighths by 3 and 7 eighths, Another piece of lovely lipstick, and this is at five and a half by three and three quarters. And I've already run it through a embossing folder. This is a cuttlebug embossing folder, and it's got miniature roses on it, flowers. I don't know if you can see them. If I put that like that, you might be able to see it, which I've already run through this with the big shot yeah and you'll also need some scraps of white for get rid of that don't need that no more for all the little bits that you're going to stamp and also some white for the frame and the bit behind I've got my scraps of white and I've got me frames. These are from that sweet. Oh my god. Let's see if I can find it and tell you what they're called. Stumps. Where's the dies? Oh yeah, Stitch So Sweetly dies. That's what these are. I've got that. And then I've also got, to make the frame, a straight stitched rectangle die, which fits inside. Now, it doesn't fit that way, so your frame's going to be a bit wider on the side than it is top and bottom. Well, mine is. But these aren't stamping up dies, this one isn't. It's a set I've already had since I first started crafting. Anyway, that's what I'm doing there to make the frame. And then this bit is to make the plain one behind. So we'll cut them out on my little machine shortly. And then this is to do the stamping. So let's cut these out. I don't think that will hold on here. Up. and this just fits on here I think it does so we're going to cut this out says there we are that's one put that in the bin might have to cut this paper down a bit Sit that on like that. And then sit this in the middle. And then stick 
some tape to hold it. And run that through. There's our frame, and there's a, a bit I'll keep for another time. Right, put these away. That goes in there, and believe it or not. These go the other side. Right. Next we're going to stamp and colour our bits and pieces we need. So, we need a shoe. I haven't put my card so where I can see it. shoe bottle of perfume what's this oh no. and a lipstick I'm not going to do the flowers because they're already cut and these I know I'll use again some other time. Lipstick. Stamp clean. Put these away. Right, colour these in. I've got um, light crumb cake for the perfume bottle. I do it this colour because one of my perfumes is near enough this colour. Um, Coco Chanel, I think it's called. It's been that long since I wore it. Right. Soft sea foam. That's mint macaron. Just as well I look then. Yep, soft sea foam. And this is just for the glass top. And there's a little bit down here which I've coloured in glass. And then um, so saffron for the label. soft sea fern again for this bit in the middle label alright for the shoe 
I used a lovely lipstick. And that's red. Right, I'm going to do this is light. So the main body of the shoe is light. The inside of the shoe I've done dark. Keep that out because I need that again. And the sole, not the sole, the insole of the shoe I did in crumb cake. And the lipstick I done in dark lovely lipstick. And this bit here that tells you what colour the lipstick is without opening it. And the tube we've done in Smoky Slate. Leaving just a tiny bit of white showing for the um, shine on the top on the Like that. That's a bit big. Make it a bit smaller. That's it. Then you cut them out using the dress to impress dies, like these three, and then for the flowers, and you will get. Them. So we can put that away. I'll cut them out later. So, all we got to do, oh no, we've got to stamp the sentiment on here. So, with lovely lipstick. I struggle to open them. stamp be as bold as your lipstick right in the middle to bleach that stamp afterwards Right, I think we're ready to stick this car together. So, with some glue. Next week, I am going to be filming. Well, when you see it, it'll be the week after this is shown. Um, some fancy fold cards. Which I hope you'll enjoy. Right. 
right, let's stick this on our card base. And then stick this inside. I'm not putting anything inside. And it hasn't got a, the sentiment doesn't say happy birthday or anything like that. So this card could be used for anything really. Use it like a, a notelet, you know, if you want to send someone a sh small note, you can send them that. As long as it's female. Right. Dimensionals. Now this, did I put it? Oh yeah, this I put on dimensionals. So one in each corner, one in the middle. We're going to place this right in the middle of the card. Like that. Now this, we're going to place like that over at an angle. And I'm going to put a small dimensional in each of these corners. like that and these will get glued so I'm just gonna oh, take these on which would help going to place these so we just place them I'm going to put that there but just need to put dimensionals round here now will I get away with a big one yeah I'm going to put one there one there and one in the corner so I'm only putting three on there. Do I need one on there? And a tiny one on the lid. Take the backs off. Because you won't get very far with the backs on. I should have put some glue there. Right. Now the lipstick. We need dimensionals on the bottom. I think it is only one I put. It is. And then glue the rest. And place that there. The shoe. Yeah. So we want a big dimensional there. All right. And a small one up here. Put 
place a bit of glue on the toe and at the side. And then we just need to put these flowers around. So I am going to do it like that. So this one needs a dimensional on that side. Place a bit of glue on where it's going to touch the other, where it's leaning against. And then these two just get laid down, glued down. And there is our card. Hope you like it. If you do, give us a thumbs up. If you want to see me more of my videos, please subscribe. And if you press the bell icon, you'll be notified of any more videos I upload, which is usually a Monday, Wednesday and Friday. All I can say is thanks for visiting, and I hope to see you again soon.